So I'll have Ignacio look into it. So the icy blue they want to see. The icy blue is not a flash gel, but that's okay. It's still really dope. So icy blue, happy gel it is today. Yes, the pink one. So happy gel is 102, the pink one, the blue one, I do believe. Yes, she is. Ya te vas, Gloria. Vas a ir a bailar. So we're gonna sculpt her out tonight. Take our famous nail forms. Ugh, this thing is no joke. Roll it really, really well. So essential, you guys, when doing nail forms, especially ours. You gotta really roll them so that way you get a beautiful seeker, okay? And actually, we will. You, you guys remember, well, if you've been following enocouture.com for a while, we always change our nail forms. And we've had this nail form for a little while already, but this is going to be the last time you see it looking like this. Because if not by the end of the year, early 2022, she will have a little facelift. She's on there tight, like that. So I like to take my Mr. Pinchy tool and then really begin to taper the form in so that way it's really tight and very cylinder shaped. And then we're going to begin to sculpt out. So you would prep the nail the same way you would any other nail. You would apply one coat of nail prep, one coat of primer, and then you could do base gel, you can do pink press on, uh, any kind of uh, color press on gel, or a pink as a base, and then apply like that. So let's get enough of these really dope icy blue for the free end. brush wipe and we're going to use the brand new slip solution which is glide and it smells like watermelon bubble gum you guys so delicious and we're going to begin to create our free end and this feels just like acrylic so it will not run it will not be messy like a lot of other gels this it gives you all the time in the world to sculpt out the fantasy. And make sure the gel is all the way on the side of the nail. You see those lines on the form? Follow them. That's what they're there for. Level it out, press, press, press. If you guys see it doesn't run, it doesn't go anywhere, it just stays wherever I want it. Making a really enjoyable application actually. This is great if you are not good at acrylic for example, or if you live somewhere where it's really hot. This will give you the same strength and durability of acrylic but with the versatility of a gel. We're gonna freeze this for about 30 seconds inside the Dazzling Darling Lamp. Because I am going to add a little bit more. I love watching this. That's so pretty, isn't it? Very angelic. Hi from Florida. We do have Klarna and we have Afterpay. Oh, thank you. She's like always coming out with great products. She's like, uh oh, I hope the post office didn't do something this year. So now we can pinch it. So we're gonna take Mr. Pinching. Begin to. Make her nice and tapered. And we can take the form off, so squeeze the form together and then we're gonna pull down like that and then the form will just come up really beautifully. Look at that. Isn't that lovely? 
Look at the C curve. So dramatic. Oh, I love it. I want a little bit more skinny. As you guys know, I love a nail with lots of spanks on. We're gonna add a little bit more. Just to even out the free edge and give it more fantasy, more glitter. You can never have enough glitter, you guys. And I'm going to do an ombre actually. I'm going to add the milky pink sequence glitter at the nail bed just to make it more fantasy. Have you guys missed me? I've missed being on Facebook too. It was giving me anxiety. I was like, I need to go live today. And don't forget you guys, the promo code for this weekend is sticker one and all the orders will have one sticker with them. If you add the promo code. Yes. Look at that. Mm, delicious. So let's freeze that for about 30 seconds and then we're going to go in with 103. So much, yes, for sure, Nikki. Oh my gosh, everybody in Louisiana, I hope you guys are safe. Tracy, how the heck do you go to the bathroom? I don't. I just leave any um, fecal matter there to air dry with these long nails. I'm very anti-hygienic. And I didn't do my, my pointer finger because I actually just did this one today. I need to do a fill up. I actually take off the oh, gel overlay and fix the other one. So let's take 103. Oh, this color is so pretty. Look at that. It's like this really pretty sequence milky pink. this at the nail bed so nice and thin at the cuticle area taper it and you can see it's so easy to get a really beautiful cuticle application with this because it will not run into the cuticle and because the color is semi sheer it will blend out really beautifully Adorbs. So let's bake this for 30 seconds. I'm going to overlay the whole nail in crystal clear happy gel. So the eternal beige and the crystal clear and the 15ml, you guys, are only $8.99 and the glitter ones are only $9.99. That is a gang of a deal. Sticker one. And it's the number one not um, spelled out, I'm sorry. That was nice with my response, she said. If you want your long natural nail, just use a pink and some wonder gel or some of the new Dom Top thick gel top coat. You're gonna love it. Dom Top is our hard 
finish gel top coat. It's thick. It has a consistency of like honey, but it makes your nails so sturdy. And it's great for encapsulating. It is brand new. And it comes in the same bottle as shiny, but in the hologram gold. So it's a Chinese sister, actually. This, the formulation is very, very similar to shiny, but different viscosity and a little bit um, harder finish. So we're going to overlay the entire nail now in the crystal clear happy gel. Look at that, no bubbles, no running. If you get glide on your skin, you don't have to worry about it because it's made with ethanol, not alcohol, so it will not dehydrate or ruin your brush. Oh my gosh, today I had a vegan chickpea salad. It tasted like medicine, you guys. I didn't eat it. But I have to admit, I do like vegan cupcakes. They're really good. Beautiful. So let's bake this for one minute inside the Dazzling Darling Lab. Brush on the Lux brush wipe. Put the lid on. Remember the final layer, we have to cure at least one whole minute inside the Dazzling Darling Lamp. 90% of the time when people have soft, um, any kind of uh, hybrid gel like this, it's because it's not fully cured. And it's most definitely 9 times out of 10 is the lamp. layer. You can use hand sanitizer or you can use glide. I'm going to use glide because that's what I have right here actually. Beautiful. I'm going to take my 100 grit file. Oh my gosh, aren't the brush wipes the best? How do you remove happy gel? Soak up. You would soak it off just like you would um, acrylic. So I'm going to take my 100 grit file and I'm going to file the nail just like I would an acrylic nail or a hard gel. Make sure those sides are nice and straight and snatched.
make sure when you're shaping the nail, you guys, straight lines, straight sharp lines. That is how you get the best shaped nail. Beautiful. So now let us begin the shaping. We're going to go in first with the first bit. I'm sorry, no, with the power top, power top. And about 35,000 RPM. Start at the free edge at a zero degree angle to make sure it's nice and straight and even. Always filing in a one way motion, never back and forth. Blend out the beautiful area, make sure she is nice and even. Don't make her too thick or humpy. Beautiful. Look at the C curve though, so sharp. Yes. And the kitchen. It's not a real kitchen though, we just call it that. Yes. So now I'm gonna take the verse bit and go into the cuticle area, make sure she's really nice and blended. Inside a little bit. Oops, great, I just knocked over my computer. Great job, Max. Smooth move, Max. There we go. Oh, it doesn't fall anymore. And again, you guys, I apologize if I can't get to every single comment. I do try my best, but right now I'm actually in a little bit of a hurry because I've got to get a ride home with my brother. So those sides are nice and straight. And then, oops, upside down, double up that C curve. It's nice and even. Even steel. Beautiful. Gonna go one more pass with the power top.
beautiful. So straight the sides. Oh, just how I like it. Smoothie and so essential for really refining the shape and getting it ultra snatched, you guys, is Twiggy. Can you guys see that the dust is so heavy, it just falls to the ground, it doesn't go in the air, making a really pleasant working environment. So if you want the fantasy of acrylic, but without the smell, or without as much uh, dust, Happy Gel is a great alternative. So take the smoothie buffer, buff in one direction, always going towards you to reduce the scratches and get a really aerodynamic shape. So now we're going to do a little layer of down top, okay, hard gel top coat. And let's overlay the entire nail. You can see the consistency, it's very funny look. This gel is also great. If you are not that great at shaping, it will really even out the surface of the nail. Oh, so beautiful. And then a little layer on the inside too, just to make her extra glass slipper-like. And then we're going to turn the head upside down for about 30 seconds or so, just to let itself level out. Beautiful. So we're going to bake this for 30 seconds because we're going to put our charm on there. So from the Showgirl charm set, just had it right here. We're gonna use a big ol' Good Witch of the North fantasy. Happy Friday! You know, I couldn't believe it was Friday today, you guys. I was like, what? It is? Dust off the fantasy. Let's get the bubble. Who's ready for the big old charm? Here she is, waiting for me. I'm gonna put this one this way. What do you guys think? So we're going to go in with a little bit of squeezing. Let's 
squeezy is very thick. But it is a no wipe. There we go. Cure that for about 10 seconds or so because I'm going to go back in with Dom Top and a liner brush and go around the charm. You gotta squeeze hard. So then take some Dom Top. And we're gonna go all around the edges, okay? And this is really gonna seal everything in so that way it doesn't go anywhere or break. Beautiful, so stunning. So because we are short on time, I would actually personally add more stones around it, but because we don't have time tonight, that's okay. It still looks pretty dope though, right? And let's bake this for one minute and set it in the middle. Hi from Massachusetts! I love this song too. I'd be quite in my sleep. Oh my gosh. with a little bit of cotton candy cuticle oil to keep the nail nice and hydrated and moist. Got my white background for the picture. What do you guys think of this new lighting too? Let me know in the comments below. Oh my god, her dog is snoring. How adorable. Very church going nail. You can hear him. Can you guys hear it? It's like ASMR. Look at that fantasy right there. Oh, we should do all the nails like this. Can you imagine? They would be gagging. Would you wear your nails like this, Ignacio? It's a little much for me. No, I think it's not enough. Oh, I'm gonna do two fingers so that way nobody thinks I'm flipping them all. Wow, look at that. So beautiful, huh? So that's 103. Yes. Awesome. Beautiful. Well, my loves. That's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this little glitter happy gel fantasy with the showgirl charms. 
And I love you guys so, so much. Don't forget to visit the website and check out all the incredible new products that we launched. And that promo code, sticker one, so you can get your free pack of stickers. And I love you guys so, so